Hello and welcome to Seven Days to Die Alpha 19 Patch 154. So we are on day 14 now. I'm gonna try out against the horde. Not much has changed. I added this room over here. I uh, had a little bit of concrete that I was able to find that I put around inside the inner wall. It's pretty much the same up here, just it's expanded out. The walls are double thick. I have wooden bars all the way around. But I guess the spider uh, zombies do not climb anymore, they just jump. So that might not be even be a, a needed thing anymore. Uh, I've got... Let's see here, I've got 345 shotgun rounds, 439 uh, 7.62, 869 mm 112 uh, uh, blunderbuss, and 42 arrows. I got one Molotov and 28 pipe bombs. I'm on game stage 48. I am level 27. My build is... Now fortitude is pretty much strength. I maxed out Motherload, Minor 69er, Sexual Tyrannosaurus. I plan on maxing out Boomstick soon in Heavy Armor. But I had to do, uh, I'm trying to get to Tinkerer and Physician so I can make Chem Station and Workbench because there is not a single working workbench in this town. So I cannot craft the motorcycle that I have all the parts for. Uh, and I didn't feel like walking all the way to this trader due to, I think it's in this wasteland biome. I believe that's what it was. But yeah. So, we're uh, almost on the horde. I've cleared out all the trees except these, which are protected by the trader boundary. And uh, yeah, it should be, should be pretty quality uh death it's 64 zombies warrior difficulty um uh, let's see what else i think everything else is default like airdrops and stuff i have those on uh, uh yeah no loot respawn obviously um uh, but yeah we're gonna start out with a shotgun because i have <laughs> that's what i have my perks in so hopefully i can kill more and then, uh, then the AK and then the 9mm. I do have one point in Machine Gunner. And then I have no points in Agility, so. Yeah, I wanted to avoid intellect as much as I could, but, like, <laughs> I went through every single garage that I could. And there was not a single working workbench, so I was able to buy a forge, but then I found the blueprints for it shortly thereafter, which is kind of annoying. So I, if I wanted to, I could have probably stay doing that and just skipped intellect completely. But I want to pick up the daring adventurer because quests are so important, and you can get two quests and twenty percent more dukes right in. So. I don't know why that's in uh, intellect, but whatever. So here we go. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully we survive. The walls are double thick, uh, fully upgraded cobblestone, so I think we should be fine for day 14. For day seven, they barely got through. Uh, I think there's like two broken blocks and maybe a third about the way, so. I just have to see what we get. Hopefully we don't get the flying ones yet. I have not built the roof. Yeah, and these wood spikes, I think they got nerfed or something because... They are not doing much damage. Oh, and I, I forgot to mention, I put the... Uh, I had these sledge... These, uh, junk turret sl sledge things, right? And they, uh... Are pretty much useless. For all intents and purposes, but I have them set on certain spots of the wall, and they should activate. Yeah, the shotgun is just too, too slow for this. Let's just use the 760. The 
obviously, yeah, if they get close to him, he will hit them, so my goal is to put enough of those junk turrets that I find. Maybe on birds. That sucks. Oh, they already broke one one block. hoping to build a uh, pump shotgun, but time did not, well, I could make it, mostly due to time, but I couldn't find the workbench to craft it on. And these wooden spikes seem completely useless now. reload fast enough. Okay. That sucks. Now we're lacerated or something. side. How did she even get up here? Oh. I noticed that the junk turret can push zombies through blocks, which is the, uh, I think that's a bug. I noticed there was a video on uh, the subreddit. A guy was pushed a guy inside the uh, trader room. So that could be, a, could be an issue. die, I think I'll just keep playing just to see where see this, because we're going to have to restart anyway. They're going to patch soon. Oh gosh, we're starving now. Yeah. 
Needed way more ammo. I'll switch the 9mm. junk or whatever it's called. Alright. Oh, another bird. Oh gosh, look at this. Wait, okay. Swap that. Probably kill me. Did that work? Oh gosh, I can hear it. Oh, so many zombies. The uh, frame rate is tanking. <laughs> Take it very hard, so that is a thing. Hitting them. Oh, my gosh. This is a, uh, this is, I think, a fail, honestly. They're inside the base. Oh gosh. I think... Unless I get another wave, I think I'm good. So two walls thick, cobblestone, not uh, probably not the best <laughs> for uh, day 14, uh, probably needed something a little bit better. Let's uh, let's go down and see if they got, all right, they didn't get in here. Oh, wow. They, uh. They went right for here, so I have this uh, this in between between like, the two bases I had going on. They never got past that, so that that worked out in my favor. Let's get some water and food going. Uh, how do you how do you get rid of a laceration? Deep laceration. Uh, first aid kit. All right, I have those. There we go. That's the first critical uh, injury I've gotten so far. Which, uh, not too bad. Uh, let's see, how's our food? Let's eat a blueberry pie. Food and water has become quite the, uh, the chore now. I have a lot of canned food. They're all used for, like, recipes. So it's like, do you want to use the canned food or go harvest some eggs? So, that's become my life. Let's check out these. We got some more 7.62 ammo. Some dukes. 
shotgun ammo. Cat, dog food. Laceration sewing kit thing. It's more over here. So yeah, we got today, ooh, the book for robotic sledge, which I guess we already had. Some kind of machine gun looking thing. Check that out here in a second. Got more ammo. There's a guy over there. Uh, sledgehammer and some stuff. Alright. Do we have frames on us? Yes. So the pipe bombs were useful, I thought. Uh, that's one too many. So yeah, I thought the pipe bombs were useful, just not uh, as useful as I thought. So that was a, a tackle assault rifle, tier one. Kind of useless. Looks nice though. So what's, how does it compare? Not bad actually. It shoots faster than the AK. Only two less damage and three less magazine size, but the mods I have on this could be affecting. Oh wait, that doesn't include mod modded value. Yeah. So yeah, that is that is day fourteen. I will uh <laughs> I will probably come back for day twenty one. And hopefully I I got some levels during that. I got three levels, so I should be able to get everything I needed. Workbench and uh chemistry station. I should be able to make gun ammo at that point and I shouldn't have any issues on the next one. I'll get a semen mixer going, put a third wall all the way around with iron spikes because these wood spikes just disintegrate. I was noticing the stone axe just melts them when you're inside. So yeah, uh, thank you for watching and have a great day.